What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to my channel, King Ken TV. And today we're going to be discussing are the Carolina Panthers getting their karma? Now, as everyone knows, man, we just got declined by Deshaun Watson. He don't want to play for us. You know, it is tough. It's tough. You know, I felt like Deshaun Watson was like one of the big key missing pieces to this team being complete. This dude is a legit elite quarterback in this league. And he would have definitely helped us, you know. Unfortunately, we're going to be having to go up against him most likely two times a year. If he goes to ATL or New Orleans, it don't matter. We're going to be seeing him at least two times a year. But he could have been on our team for 17 games a year, you know. But, hey, it is what it is. This is where karma, from what most fans are saying, is what we're receiving, man. As y'all know, on this day – well, yesterday was the day we released Cam two years ago. You know, we – Pretty much did them dirty, if you ask me. And some fans' opinion, they're going to be like, hey, man, it was time to move on. We had a new regime. They need their guy to come in. They can't have Cam in there because they not his. They not their guy. Cam wasn't their guy, man. Tepper, Tepper, he knew Cam. Cam was kind of his guy a little bit because he spent some time with him. But you had Ron Rivera going out, and you had this dude, Matt Rule, coming in. And some fans will say, hey, the way they did Cam was wrong. If you was going to release Cam, why not release him before signing a new QB? If you don't remember, let me give you a little bit of history. Cam Newton was coming off an injury. Cam Newton thought he was going to be the guy. We just hired a new coach. Looked like we were starting fresh over with the coaching because Ron Rivera was getting out of here, heading on up to Washington, D.C. Well, I guess Ron was like, you know what? This is not going to work. He felt like he wanted to work with Cam, but it just wasn't his guy. He wanted to bring in, you know, Teddy Bridgewater, three years, 62 million. We know how that went. But once again, hindsight is 2020 for most of these fans. And for me as well, you know, you never know. But for me, I know the way they handle Cam situation is what we're dealing with today, where they call as karma. You know, Cam Newton got cut pretty much, well, not cut, but they told him he could trade, he could get traded. But pretty much he got released, y'all. He got released after every quarterback position for almost all teams except for the Patriots was filled up. Now, if we would have cut Cam early on, maybe he would have had a better chance of getting with a team, but it seemed like the Panthers were still optimistic. They didn't they didn't want to let him go, but at the same time, it was like, all right, let's just go ahead and start on over. This ain't working. Cam ain't our guy. We got the new regime. We want they guys coming in. They got to get rid of the old guys. As you know, Greg Olson was leaving. Thomas Davis was leaving. Luke retired. You know, all the main core guys was leaving, y'all. Y'all got to remember that. Y'all have to remember that. I know it was two years ago, but it wasn't that long ago. I remember it like it was yesterday. Next thing we know, Teddy Bridgewater is getting ready to sign his contract, but Cam Newton is still on the team. We're trying to discuss how can we have 20 mil and Cam and 21 mil and Teddy on the same team. That's 40 plus million dollars. We can't have that. It's too much cap, too, too, too much, too much money being held up in two players. So what do they do? They release Cam to save money. I think they released him, like you know, in March 17th. All the spots pretty much gone. All the spots pretty much gone except for the Patriots. So this is pretty much our karma. You know, when it comes to Deshaun Watson now, Deshaun probably asked them boys, hey, man, how is it over in Carolina? Cam won't let you know. Personally, them two boys, is they locked in. They they locked in, you know. And it's tough. It's tough. Because at the end of the day, whether you want to believe it or not, this is kind of like karma. He declined us two years later on the same day we released Cam. It's tough. It's tough. David Tepper, Matt Rule, y'all got to – y'all boys got to get it together. If it's up to me, David, get this man out of there. But I'm going to say that for another video. Till then, I'm going to see y'all in the next one. Panther fans, make sure y'all let me know what y'all thinking. Y'all let me know what y'all thinking. Is this karma? Let me know in the comment section. Make sure y'all like, subscribe. And till then, I'll see y'all next time.